who else loves bubble wrap as much as me? Oh my god, I love it so much. That was the little packaging of the new drop that I got from Beauty Evolution. Um, it was basically six different lippies from Switch Beauty. It's launching on the weekend of Beauty Revolution, which is happening in Joburg on the 6th and 7th of April. And they were kind enough to send me the invite to attend. I am attending, so if you are, do let me know in the comments and I'd love to meet you on the day. BTW Beauty Revolution is basically like a beauty fair for South Africa. It's the biggest one that I think it's had yet. So I'm super, super keen and excited to go. There's amazing brands that's gonna be there as well. Um, and masterclasses from amazing makeup artists. So Switch Beauty is launching a new product called the Air Matte Lipstick. They have six different shades in this product range. It's Thick Double C, 420, You're Welcome, Supreme Double Tap, and Gen Z. Super cute names. What I love about Switch is that they're really on trend and like young and fun, and I love the names that they used for these lipsticks as well, which is really cool. Let me just go into the packaging. Love that it is pink. What? I love pink, guys. Pink and yellow are my absolute favorite colors. I don't know if you can see from my header, but those are my favorite colors. I'm literally wearing pink. My background's pink. Everything is pink today. So, like, I'm so happy about this packaging. Super cute. And that they have six shades is awesome. So that's just my first impressions of the names of these products as well as the packaging. I think it's super cute, super on chain, super young. It's something that I think that Switch Beauty's target marketing clients and customers will really love because I love this is super cute. So yeah, because this is only launching on the weekend of the 6th and 7th April, I thought it would be cute if I did a little lip swatch for you guys. I normally do lip swatches on my Instagram. Um, so I thought that a YouTube video just showing you guys and speaking about the products would be a bit cool. It's not something that I do a lot, um, but I really want to start doing more YouTube videos and I thought this would be a really cool thing to do today. So let me start off with, normally I like to go from my lightest to darkest because then it also doesn't like um, stain my lips until the end. What I'm going to do is I'm going to take all of these out of the boxes. It's individually sealed with plastic wrap with perforated little things so you can just break it open. You don't need a scissor. See? Yep. I'm just going to break it open. Okay, so I had a look at the shades. I just opened up the lid and basically there's three kind of nudes and pinky colors and then there's two like ready colors i'm like ready pinky but red kind of shades two red shades and three nude slash mauve pink kind of shades so i'm going to start off with the nude slash mauve shades first so that doesn't stain my lips and i'll let you guys know how it feels and you guys can see how it looks so let's jump right into it okay so this is the shade thick On my lips, it feels really comfortable. It's not super drying, but it's not super moisturizing either. Maybe I should have primed my lips before. I'm gonna try priming my lips after I remove this one and then I'll let you guys know if it makes a difference. I actually have the Switch Beauty, um, the Prime Kit here with me. So I'll use their products because surely the brand would make products that go with each other, if that makes sense. So I'll use that to prime my lips. But right now, my lips still feel very really, like mobile. A lot of the times with other matte lipsticks, it kind of doesn't feel very really comfortable. Like you can feel your lips pulling. I don't feel that with this. And I really like this color. It's a beautiful nude color. I think it's a very really nice everyday color. Feels super comfortable. Nothing's on my hands. Is there not something on my hand? doesn't transfer guys now that's great it does not transfer and I hardly have to wait like I really didn't have to wait any time it's not a liquid lipstick I'm gonna take this off and we'll check in the next one after I prime my lips so I'm going in with the prime time kit now I'm gonna prep my lips I obviously don't know the longevity of the lipsticks because I haven't eaten with it haven't worn it out for a full day but what I'll do is I'll wear it this week and then I'll just 
post on Instagram stories to let you guys know how it lasts and things. So next up is your welcome. That's how your welcome looks. Your welcome has more of a pink shade to it, whereas thick had more of a nude shade to it. of the lipstick is a bit better after you prep and prime it. I'm gonna just remove this one and then I'll do the next shade. This is how double tap looks. It's not as pink as the other one from what I'm looking at. Um, it looks more of like a... Uh, ooh, it looks more coral. So these lipsticks feel very cream in texture. Like creamy. And they glide on actually really, really easily and really nicely. But like I said, it does glide on better once your lips are primed and exfoliated. But I'm not going to do that for every single lip um, color that I put on other than the beautiful area. This is the final kind of finish of double tap. It is like a salmon, coral kind of a pinky, leaning towards pinky orange color. I really like this one. There's three more left. So this one is for 20. More brown with, it looks like it has a little bit of a pink in, oh, no, nope, fully brown. Fully brown. This color is so, so nice, wow. I think this might actually be one of my favorites. This and the first one, which was the nude one. Mm, this is like a chocolate brown, I love it. Okay, next up, there's two more left, Supreme and Generation Z, Gen Z, so let me do Supreme next. So it's like a bright red shade, and... What I like about this, that a lot of other lipsticks that are red, <laughs> that I have, it actually doesn't transfer. Um, so with a lot of my other red lipstick, it either goes on my teeth or it goes around my mouth. And so far, this is not transferring, which is great. Yeah, there's hardly anything that's on my hands. So that's great. I'm actually really enjoying these air mats. They really are comfortable. I'm not gonna lie, they're really comfortable. And they are very pigmented. Okay, last color is Gen Z. So let me just remove this quickly. So this one, just by looking at it, it looks not as red. Well, it looks more maroon than the other one. I think the one before this was Supreme. Yeah, so the Supreme was more of a bright red and this is more of like a deeper red. It actually looks more plum now that I'm putting on this color. Okay, so this one definitely looks way more pink than it does red on your lips. In this thing it looked more deep red, but it's actually not. It's more of like a deep pink. I would have grouped that with the pinky, more the nudes and the pinks, rather than the reds and the browns. Um, but it's really pretty. It's kind of like a plum pink, plum pink, plum pink or fuchsia color. I love that word, fuchsia. <laughs> but yeah, this is Gen Z. So, full feedback. These are actually really, really nice. I enjoyed them. I'm enjoying wearing them. They don't feel like dry on my lips. They don't stick. They do look like matte lipsticks on my lips though, like you can see the lines, it does look like it's a little bit dry, but it doesn't feel super dry. Um, my lips are quite comfortable talking, I'm not like feeling the pull. <laughs> the packaging is super super cute, it wasn't too difficult to remove with my micellar that I normally use. So this one was really nice and easy to use. I would suggest that you pair it up with the Switch Beauty Prime Time Kit, so that's the exfoliator and the moisturizer just for the pure fact that it is a matte lipstick and you want your lips to be moisturized and feeling nourished um, and for it to just apply better so i would advise that 
and yeah I really really liked it and I like the shade range um, I think that they could have had a slightly deeper color I really thought that that red would have like a deep red I would have loved a deep red but maybe in future they'll extend the shade range and there'll be more darker colors because right now there's just like one dark brown and yeah that's about it it's a bright red and then the rest, the rest are like pinks and nudes hopefully they do extend the range but i'm pretty happy with these six lipsticks and yeah i, just, I don't know how much it is gonna cost but I'm sure it won't be too bad and I think that I definitely will wear this going forward so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one please make sure that you like and subscribe and comment below if you liked any of these shades if you think that you're gonna try it out what your thoughts are of Switch Beauty or of their products and yeah I'll see you in the next one bye